So, uh, hi, it's me again. Look at the number in the top right corner, 1.1.0. Yes, there's been an even bigger update now. In fact, this was already done by the time the 1.0.4 video went up. So yeah, sorry, but I guess I might as well leave that uploaded anyway. As in, I might as well let that go up anyway, instead of this one. Maybe, yeah. Yeah, the more videos, the better. Yum. Anyway, it's, it's not like these videos being uploaded is taking away from any other videos like Doom or anything, because these are just extra little bonus things on days that would have otherwise had nothing anyway. But yeah. So, it's quite a bit of a bigger one this time. Bunch of little changes. Nothing too, like, major. Just some little extra effects and minor fixes, but the main thing there's a new modifier, two times health. Because towards release I was thinking, is this game a bit hard? I think it might be a bit hard, at least for some people. And I was considering changing the hearts to be two hits rather than one hit each. Sort of closer to the Zelda feel, where each heart is four hits, doesn't it? Yeah. So uh, I've added this option as sort of a, an easy mode, I guess, or an easier mode. I've still actually died with it, so I think it feels right. But you know, it's there as an option. By default, you you still have the normal health. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna do this just for the hell of it. So yeah. Oh, why is that there? All right, because I was testing stuff. Anyway, let's just do another quick randomizer run here. I guess I'll probably keep doing this for each update that feels worth it. We're just randomizing enemies and item positions. I probably won't remember each little thing. A lot of them were just little things, little updates and changes. Um, but, but there was one thing, I think I was talking about it in the last video, the 1.0.4 video, where if you kill enemies with the hammer at a certain time and the explosion finishes them off, I find it really satisfying how... Oh, right, I was confused. How the sort of delayed enemy death puff is satisfying. I've kind of added that in for some other enemies, just when you kill them normally. In fact, I think this... I don't know. No, I don't think I did do it for this one. There's sort of a little delay to some of the enemy deaths. But only for some enemies. Because while they're... yeah, that one's still fine. Um, yeah. Well, no sword for me, because just before they explode, it's only a very slight thing, like, I don't know, a quarter of a second, quarter of a second before they actually explode, but if you do run into them during that time, they can still hurt you, so you've got to be careful, but it doesn't really change much. You're not really likely to. Not many enemies do it anyway, but... Uh, no, we'll wait until we find a better enemy. With the Bowman Archers, I can demonstrate one of the things that I changed. I could demonstrate it with him as well, but not really. I ain't got the spell for it. Oh yeah, I made them immune to fire, by the way. The fireball spell. So yeah. Oh, you might notice that grass disappeared down there as well. Yes, fire shots now destroy grass, as in enemy fire shots do. Your fire shots always did anyway. But yeah. Just one of the minor changes. There's a bowman. Let's get rid of these. And then I can show you. Just a nice little fun addition. Oh no! Haha! -ha. You can hit some shots now. That's pretty cool. It feels good. Especially with the bigger weapons. Um, I can't really demonstrate it, but I fixed something with these. There was some times where they could like come up under you and you would get stuck on them. But now I've made them, like if that happens, they go back down and move again. So yeah, because that wasn't very fair. Because if you get stuck on them, they can just shoot you and you can't escape. And 
I've also stopped you being able to take damage from running into some enemies, like the, the bowman, because why would that hurt? But, but running into some enemies, it makes sense to take damage like the spearman, even if you run into its face, but you know. Perf. Oh. Yeah, we're just going to do a quick run here, although, well, it might not be so quick because the items are in different positions. Oh. Oh yeah, these, you can run into them now. They only hurt you when they're moving. So that's nice. And as you can see, I've got half a heart now. So yeah. It's just a nice little thing. Like, I wanted to preserve the challenge but add a way to make it a bit more accessible as well, you know? Because I want as many people as possible to be able to enjoy this. Oh, oh, oh! Haha! <laughs> it just, it's fun. It is. It's just fun. Anyway, let's, let's skill our way through here. Can I no-hit it without any light? Yeah, I bloody well can. Huh! <laughs> Cheers. I'm sorry for doing so many playthroughs of this. It's just fun. Fun keeping you up to date with what's going on. Oh! I keep getting that. That keeps being in like the first locked chest that I open. Every time I play this thing, every time I test it, I hope you're not getting sick of seeing it. I don't know what I'll upgrade. Let's try and upgrade the spear this time if I can find it. Good, it's not there. I'm surprised that in all my test plays I haven't had like the Jember spawn up there yet or anything. Like, lots of stuff here. This is a cool place because, you know, usually these two are mimics. But with the randomizer. They're unlikely to be. So it's basically three, three, three free items, yeah. That's a sentence. We haven't actually seen any enemies that have a delayed explosion yet, but... One day we might. Oh yeah, uh, uh. Go away, water blob shots. You can destroy those as well. I forgot to add the destroy sound effect. Let me just make a note of that. Oh, oh, I got hit when I unpaused. Yeah, I just made a note. Just a quick o. Yeah. It is actually quite common to get hit by those. Ah! Red slime shots. So. I also wanted to add a way to destroy those two. Ah! Uh, a lot of the enemy shots in the game can be destroyed now in, in certain ways, other than just the barrier. The barrier blocks everything, but like lava shots you can destroy with frost magic, and water shots you can destroy with fire. You know, stuff like that, just little things that isn't likely to make a huge difference, but just little, little attention to detail things I suppose. Just for fun. Oh, it's hard to do. I wouldn't recommend it, it's just there for a little thing that might happen sometimes, you know? Who's got a little thing? If you if you manage to hit the arrows, you know, skill play could get, get you out of some dodgy situations. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Cheers for the dosh, mate. I can't destroy the grass right now. I ain't got anything. I don't actually remember what enemies have a delayed explosion. I know the knights do, but still, it's very, very minor. So it's 
doesn't really stand out or anything, it was just a fun thing I wanted to add, just for the hell of it, no point going over there just yet. Bum, bum. Yeah, I'm not going to do it, because that will take forever. I think they've got like 22 health or something. Or did the archers have a delayed explosion? I think they did. Five. They have nine health. Six, seven, eight. Yeah. Instead of just exploding when they get hit, it's just very, very slight. In fact, there's not really much point, but why not? You know? I just wanted to. Right, there's the spear, so we can go and get that. Have we got enough gems for level one wave? We have. Yeah, let's get that. I can't cast it though, can I? No, it costs eight. I need one mana upgrade for that. All right. Buy a few keys. In fact, I might as well buy all six because we haven't really got the spear to upgrade right now. We need a mana upgrade if you don't mind. Let's go in the dungeon see if we can find one. That would be nice too. Get out of the way. They are of course easier to hit. Right, I can't go that way without the sword. The arrows are of course easier to hit with, like, not the fist. Because of course, the fist is the shortest range. Or is the hammer? I think the hammer might be a shorter range, but it's got like a bit more of a lingering hitbox. Very slightly, but... That's not a mana upgrade. But it's something. You know, now health upgrades feel even better. That was one of the things I was concerned about if I was gonna make each heart two hits. Because, you know, I, I liked the challenge where, like, every upgrade you get, it's, it feels nice, because that's another whole hit you can take. But I guess now it's even better, because it's another whole two hits you can take. And I guess it makes sense that... Oh, there we go, free mana. It makes sense that... Wait, yeah, I do have eight now. It makes sense that I don't necessarily need the um, extra hits, but you know, since I made the game. So of course it's going to be easier for me, so I think it just makes a nice little bit of a difference for... Bloody hell, just, just send me. Nice little bit of a difference for people who didn't make the game. Right, let's get everywhere. Go get my mana back. So we can go get the spear and start doing stuff. It's going to be fun with the spear, because you can hit them from miles away. I mean, in the staff it used to be a spear, but since it was the weakest weapon in the game, I thought I would change it into a staff, because why would a spear do so little damage? It's a bloody spiky nipple. No, it's not a nipple. But, you know, it, it was very spiky and stuff, as a spear tends to be. Not enough yet. That's a bit of a slow start, isn't it? Might as well get frost. So yeah, now, due to the change in the health... Ugh. I guess I'll have to add it to the guide. Like, normally the menu would say 4 HP, but now it says 8 even if you don't have double HP on. So that means every enemy does two hits usually when you haven't got the um, thingy on the <clears throat> the two health modifier times two health rather. So yeah, I'll have to 
I'll have to add details of how much damage the enemies and stuff do in the guide. You know what? I'm sick of having to go around. Let's go destroy the grass. Maybe a waste of mana, but... Double destroy. Um, let's do it from here, I guess. Oh, look at that delayed explosion. That was cool. I don't know why, I just like that. Anyway. <clears throat> In we go. Yeah, 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 yum. What a dodgy room. With this combination of enemies. And hearts still give you a full heart back. So don't worry about that. Potions too, they give you... Oh! Hang on. This is a time. No, get back on the spikes. Oh dear. They don't like it. That's alright though. It's like they're jiggling trying to get off. Oh. oh! There's another new thing. Do you see the, the wizard shot? It used to be just the same as the shots from the lurkers. But now it's its own thing. It looks like magic. It's cool, I reckon. You might not, but I do. Oh. Get out of here. Wait, we've got frost as well, we can demonstrate. Huh. Oh, wait. Wait, you see it's not it's not the not the thing you wanna be going for, but yeah it works. If you really need it to. What a tot of a room with not not much damage. As in when you have not much damage. Get out of here. Right, that's both the temple keys. <clears throat> so now we could go. Well, I mean we still need the third one obviously, but... You know. Just use the fist for the chests. Uh. I ain't got enough damn mana. I think there was only ore or something over there anyway though. Ah, eh. cheer up. What was that? I pressed Q, that's what. Right, now we can upgrade the spear a little bit. Unfortunately, we have to wait to upgrade it again to get some damage, but... In fact, that's bugger all. Not a very good upgrade at all, but you know, you gotta have some not good upgrades. go. Now perhaps we can. No. I feel like money is coming in slowly today. Probably because I ain't got the sword or anything. Oh. Yum. Oh, yeah, let's go get that. Now we can go everywhere. This probably will be the last video of this game. Unless something else major gets updated for some reason, like a, another new modifier maybe. Probably not. Did that even hit you twice? Oh no, it isn't ore over there, it's a damn chest. I don't know how much health you have left. Oh, there we go, see? It's also fun having the money puff out, 
just before they die. I don't know why I say C as if I haven't already shown you. Wait, what was that? That was some rapid fire. Alright, oh, we can go in there as well now. What we got? Ah! I'll tit. Now we don't have to waste magic anymore. <clears throat> All the stuff. Well, unfortunately, we still can't get through the damn bushes. I want to know what's over there. Maybe the sword. Puff. Guess we can go get this chest as well now. And a bunch of other stuff. Rom? Oh. Bering. Oops, I left a coin. Sorry. Ow. I'm still very alive though. That's because I made the game, so it's okay. Now I would have died, though. Right, what we got? Yummy stuff. As always. I guess it's also kind of getting to the point now where I don't really need to record this anymore. I've had my fun recording it. And I hope you've had your fun watching it or playing it if you have. Yum. Stuff everywhere. Oh, what? Wait, what? Oh, right, I didn't go there. I thought that was the cave with the invisible wall. As in fake wall, but no, it wasn't. Come here. I was going to use wave, but I ain't got it. I mean, I ain't got the magic. Guess we might as well go get the ore. I think I've got enough now anyway, though. Yeah, probably. Probably, verily. I've already been over there. Wait, okay. There's no exclamation point on the the puzzle in the middle of the water. That means it's a money chest or a mimic. So that's alright. Might as well go get me me mana back. Boobity boobity. I ain't got the sky crystal yet, which is a bit annoying. Whoa, I hit both. I knew that kind of thing was possible, but I've never done it. That was fun. Crotch. What? Sorry. Just or piss off. Ha <laughs> ha. Yes. I think I actually got shot because of the slightly delayed death there. That's evil, that is. Because I think I hit him just before he shot. Oh dear, hello. No. No, my friend. We don't even need to go in there. Although I guess we do need the money. Maybe not. Did you just know you didn't take damage? You flashed because you went down and came back up. It's only going to be a key or an ore. 
which we don't really need anymore, but... <clears throat> I think it's only ever key or ores. I mean keys or ore in the not locked chests. More ore, I can't be asked. That room's tedious. No. I guess I do still have to find the other temple key. Oh, I ain't got enough magic. I was trying to explode the room. Right, before we leave, what's over here? Oh! Uh, oh! I guess having like the two times health also makes it better um, because you can't get all of the health upgrades in one run. Like there's only four in total. So that's kind of good, I suppose. Overall, I reckon I'm happy. And it's optional anyway for people who want like the the dev challenge or whatever you want to call it. There we go. Right then. Oh, hello. I'll have you. Now we can truly go, I reckon. Where's that damn sword, though? It's got to be behind that tree. Maybe it's in the temple. Anyway. Yum. Maybe we'll... No, we won't buy some potions. There's no point. No point buying anything. Actually, yeah, I guess it could be in that top right secret as well. There's a few places it could be. Let's go have a look. One final look. Ah oh, yeah. I don't I don't know if you've seen it. There's the dream form of the spear. It's the least interesting, but if you hit it with the tip, so at the tip of the spear and the zappy bit hits, it does more damage. But like the zappy bit alone. As the menu says, it only does two damage. So yeah, I don't know. I might want to make it a bit, a bit more interesting at some point because the spear is kind of boring. I mean, the staff. I don't like it. I want it to be fun, but it's just kind of hard to balance it because it's mainly for the convenience of range for people who don't want to get hit and just want want the safety. It wouldn't be very fun if you could just kill everything really quickly without being in any danger. At least it's got some decent speed now as well. But you know. I don't know. Okay, I was just checking that did use both of my keys. You never know. You never know when a bug might still be lurking. There it is. Not that we need it now. Ow! What the hell? Oh. I must have hit it with the, um, zappy bit. Which is annoying. Uh, yeah. Let's just go to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gate's open, loser. Oh, yeah. Dream weapon effects also destroy the the nightmare shots now. As you can see. What the hell? God, there's still some shots that weirdly overlap, even though I, I fixed it so that that can't happen. It literally cannot. But apparently it can. But yeah, the effect of the... the well, the dream effect is more fun with the sword and the hammer. Because it destroys the shots. Just imagine shooting a, a sword beam through all of those and destroying them. 
very cool, isn't it? It might be, you'll have to play and find out. Play the new version, that is. In fact, shall I just show you? Let's just use a cheat. There are cheats in this game if you look in the guide. Look at that. Cool. The sword itself, as in the weapon itself, doesn't, but... Oops. Hang on. But just the dream effect. Which means the fist doesn't do anything. Even though the fist itself is the dream effect. But whatevs. Perth. You can even poke him in the eye with the staff now. And it's in its dream form. Even though it only does two damage, so it's not worth it. Come on. This is all very illegal. I'm the Dream Master. Oh, that was weird. They got hit way after. Because of the, um... Lingering electricity effect, or whatever. Anyway, yeah. Right, that's probably the last time I'll be showing off this game. Sorry. I'm sorry for all of it. Maybe it won't be, I don't know. We'll see. Thanks for watching again. God, have you watched all of these? Why? Sorry. Anyway, yeah. So if this game was previously too hard for you, now that is there. If you want to give it another bash. Otherwise, you can still play it normally as well. 14 hits, no. Seven hits. Anyway, yeah, thanks for watching. Goodbye.